is talking green and the TCI is joining in this babble. But this talk is good because it's followed up by action. Action to broaden education. Action to encourage community participation. And action to begin the process of change for the better. Days after the official Earth Day on Tuesday, April 22nd, the Department of Environment and Coastal Resources was still celebrating and celebrating strongly. On Saturday, April 26, a full day of activities dedicated to the preservation of the environment was held beginning with the official launch of the No Single Use Plastic Bag Campaign. The aim of the series of events was to bring about awareness to the TCI community on the preservation of the environment with special focus on the coral reefs. One of the major problems facing our reef is relating to the plastic bag that many of us over the years have not made the connection. This year we are putting the dots together and making people more aware of the impacts of plastic bag and by so doing this launching ceremony here is to encourage people to do something about that. According to Wesley Clairvaux, Director of Environment and Coastal Resources, plastic bags, as harmless as they may seem, create extreme problems for marine life when they get into the surrounding waters. The department, we are witness to some of the impacts that these plastic bags have on the marine environment. We have been called on rescue missions with regard to sea turtles that are suffocating from swallowing plastic bags. It is something that we all can do. We, everyone in the Turks and Caicos Islands can lend a hand towards the protecting of our environment by simply changing their practice or promoting or making use of these cloth bags. Before taking the campaign to the streets, a mahogany tree was planted at the National Environmental Center and the department opened its new Environmental Science Library. The library will be open to the public and houses books and other reference material on the environment. Anyone who wishing to find any information about the environment, particularly about the TCI environment, environmental impact assessments and the like, will be available here at the library for viewing. And also we encourage school kids to come here and also teachers to give students assignments about the environment to come here and make use of it. Then it was time to hit the streets, or more specifically, the grocery stores. Members from the DECR went to work at the IGA supermarket bagging groceries with the new non-plastic bags and handing out Earth Day t-shirts to the shoppers. According to the department officials, the day was a complete success and they hope that the awareness will continue throughout the year. For WIV4 News, I'm Joy Del Trail.